We've been through probably a dozen floods that are that come into the street in, in the front of the building, and this this appears to be this is the scariest one. And I've been here I've been here personally for 20 years and, and seen some pretty bad things. And I think the biggest challenge is when you go upstream into the Reading area, that's where the the flood starts. You know, that's where it comes from. It's not what comes in from the beach. And with all the rain that's going to be happening up there, plus the hurricane, uh, this is the worst scenario for us. I mean, we're basically, uh, we're almost like a castle with a moat. The water comes in next to us, goes down the street, and it meets in the middle, and it rises. And we're about three feet above everyone else, so typically when there's a bad flood in Maniunk, we escape it. You know, maybe it'll, it could be by six inches or eight inches. And uh, this go-around, we have extra sandbags on the inside and the outside, and plastic sheeting. I've even caulked the doors. And... My, my fear is that this is going to be the one that really gets inside the building and causes a lot of damage. And you can see with there's been so much preparation. We've got all the furniture up, either out of the building, upstairs, or up on things that won't be affected by water or mud, which is really the worst. We could be called into work to try to seal everything up so the water usually runs over to both buildings. And we usually come in and try to seal everything up, sandbags, steel doors, and everything. I think we're going to get a lot of water. Yeah, it usually come up to the um, the meters right there, all the way up to the top.